Polytechnic University of the Philippines PUP, Filipino, Politecnicong Universidad ng Pilipinas, is a research and coeducational state university in the Philippines. It was founded on October 19, 1904 as the Manila Business School MBS, and as part of Manila's public school system. It was eventually promoted to Chartered State University in 1978, by virtue of Presidential Decree 1341. PUP has more than 20 campuses and extensions across Central Luzon, Southern Luzon and Metro Manila. With over 70,000 enrolled students, PUP claims to be the largest state university in the Philippines by student population. In 2013, PUP ranked 300 plus in the QS Asia University Rankings. In the same year, the QS World University Rankings Country File on the Philippines also placed PUP third in Life Science and Medicine, fifth in Natural Science Chemistry, fourth in Economics and Econometrics, and fifth in Communication and Media Studies. Fifty-eight PUP programs have been accredited by the Accrediting Agency of Chartered Colleges and Universities in the Philippines AACCUP, while two, Journalism and Filipino, were granted Center of Development status by the Commission on Higher Education. A 2018 survey of 503 JobStreet employers ranked PUP as the top choice of employers in general, the top choice in the business process outsourcing BPO industry, and the second choice in the manufacturing, IT, and banking industries. The Universal Access to Quality Tertiary Education Act of 2017 mandates free tuition and fees for all students of state universities and colleges. Before the act was enforced, the tuition was exactly 12 pesos, roughly 24 US cents per unit for undergraduate students. Students may opt out of the subsidy and choose to pay the full tuition instead. PUP has a reputation for student activism against tuition fee hikes. PUP S athletic team is known as the Mighty Maroons and plays in the National Capital Region Conference of the State Colleges and Universities Athletic Association SCUAA. The team also played in the National Athletic Association of Schools, Colleges and Universities NAASCU, in 2013. Its official volleyball team, the Pup Lady Radicals, played in the Shakey's V League in 2015. History PUP traces its roots from the Manila Business School which was founded by the civil government of the Philippines and was established on October 19, 1904. It is also referred to as the Manila School of Commerce. The school was delegated to create businessmen and businesswomen for government service and private employment. It was a part of the city school system of Manila which was under the superintendence of Gabriel A. O'Reilly. It held its first classes at a small two-story building in No. 38 Gunau Street Corner Arlegui in Quiapo. The influx of students from different provinces elevated the school's status as an insular, or national, school and was renamed as Philippine School of Commerce in 1908. The school moved out from its Arlegui building and continued its operation on Goldenberg Mansion located on Gen. Solano Street in San Miguel which was formerly occupied by the Bureau of Audits and the Philippine Senate. Its faculty was composed of Filipino and American teachers. For administrative purposes, the school was placed under the administration of the Superintendent of City Schools but kept its status as a national school. In 1933, the school was merged with the Philippine Normal School and the Philippine School of Arts and Trades. During the merger that lasted 12 years, PSC was administered by the PNS superintendent and its students who completed their courses were considered graduates of Philippine Normal School. The existence of the Philippine School of Commerce caught the attention of President Manuel L. Quezon. In his graduation address on March 26, 1940 at the Rizal Memorial Stadium, he promised a new building for the school where its graduates can be recognized. Two years later, Congressman Manuel A. Alazarte together with the department head of the Philippine School of Commerce Luis F. Reyes, formulated a bill to this effect and present it to the Congress. Unfortunately, the plan was not carried out because of the Japanese occupation of the Philippines that occurred between 1942 and 1945 during World War II. Shortly after Philippine liberation, Superintendent Luis F. Reyes resumed the task for the re-establishment and rehabilitation of the school. 
The Bureau of Public Works released more than 8,000 pesos for the repairs and maintenance of public buildings of which the school is a beneficiary. The ruins of the Normal Hall was reconstructed and the college resumed its classes there on August 4, 1946. In 1947, the Philippine Normal School converted the Normal Hall into a dormitory, resulting in the Philippine School of Commerce to resign to its former lot, where it held classes with overcrowded rooms. Because of its unbearable condition, the school made representations in the Philippine Alien Property Administrator, through Malacanang and the Department of Foreign Affairs, for the acquisition of the Lepanto site in Sampaloc. By August 4, 1947 the school transferred to its new Lepanto campus, and Luis F. Reyes was appointed as its superintendent. The Philippine School of Commerce was elevated into a college and was renamed as the Philippine College of Commerce in 1952 by virtue of Republic Act 778. Superintendent Luis F. Reyes became the president of the college. It broadened its course offerings and the Annex Building, which had formerly housed the Congress of the Philippines, was turned over to the college. The Business Writers Association of the Philippines awarded the college the title of Business College of the Year in 1955. In 1962, Dr. Nemesio E. Prudent was appointed as president. He implemented numerous initiatives that greatly benefits the students such as student loans and the inclusion of the student council in the policy-making body of the college. Three years later, President Diosdado Macapagal proclaimed that the Pandacan site of the Bureau of Animal Industry, which is a slaughterhouse, to be reserved for the exclusive use of the college. In 1968, the college offered social science courses related to business education. Also, the college was granted to use and dispose the A. Mabina campus in Santa Mesa, Manila adjoining the former site of National Development Corporation, which will eventually become the main and flagship campus of the institution. It was also awarded the title lot for its S.H. Loyola Lepanto campus. As a hotbed of student activism, a handful of its students participated in the first quarter storm, one of the factors leading up to the declaration of martial law in 1972. The college moved out from its Lepanto campus and completed its transfer to the A. Mabina campus in 1971. Through Presidential Decree 1341 that was proclaimed on April 1, 1978, the Philippine College of Commerce became a chartered state university and was accordingly renamed as the Polytechnic University of the Philippines. It strengthened PUP Manila campus. Hold as the main and flagship campus because it hosts the offices of PUP. S. Executive officials. In 1979, the construction of the main library, the University Canteen, Sampaguita Building, the Interfaith Chapel, and the addition of third-fifth floors of the main academic building was completed, although the fifth floor finished its construction in 1984. The Institute of Technology was also created, which was later known as the College of Engineering and Architecture. Because of the addition of more technical, undergrad and postgraduate programs, PUP adopted the Cluster Colleges, set up in 1984, where each college prepared the program and supervised all the subjects required in the degree program offered in the college. In 1986, Dr. Nemesio E. Prudent reassumed the presidency of PUP. Under his presidency, PUP developed its physical facilities in Manila and in other campuses. He also formulated a new PUP logo, hymn, and philosophy and had the university's organization restructured. PUP experience enhancement in its academic and co-curricular programs, upsurge in cultural activities, and maintains a dynamic physical education and sports program during his term. Because of what Prudent did, he was credited with revitalizing public education in the Philippines by institutionalizing much-needed changes in the state university he led, which will eventually become the largest state university. In the 1990s, PUP had its first lady president appointed, Dr. Zeneda A. Olonan. PUP established its Information and Technology Center, ICTC, in 1999. It started its operations a year later in 2000. By February 2000, PUP was conferred by the Commission on Higher Education as a Center of Development for Excellence code, in Information Technology. PUP was also recognized as a virtual center for technology innovation in information technology by the Department of Science and Technology. PUP celebrated its centennial year in 2004. The countdown for the centennial started in 1999. In 2003, President Gloria Macapagal Arroyo proclaimed 2004 as the PUP centennial year. 
She also declared that the Pup Mabina campus be the official and permanent home of the Mabina Shrine. The shrine was transferred to Pup to protect it from the flood control project of the Metro Manila Development Authority. As a part of its centennial year, plans were drawn to construct the Diosdado P. Magapagal Law Center College of Law Building in Lepanto Campus and Freedom Plaza. Only the plaza was constructed and the lot at Lepanto Campus where the law center is supposed to stand remains empty. Pup made the world. S largest human rainbow during its centennial celebration held in Rizal Park to highlight the signing of the Declaration of Peace to be put before the United Nations. Pup's largest human rainbow is made of 30,365 students, faculty, staff and alumni. In 2005, Dr. Dante G. Guevara was appointed as the officer in charge of Pup. A year later, he became the acting president. Notable achievements during his term include the creation of the web-based application system PUP iApply, the designation of PUP as Southeast Asia's first railway academy in 2007, and PUP becoming as one of the sites for the entire nation's commemoration of the 110th anniversary of the proclamation of the Philippine independence. Among the notable structures built during this time include the Mabina Obelisk, Freedom Plaza, and the Fort Santiago replica walls of the Luntiang Pilipinas Forest Park. Despite these achievements, however, Dr. Guevara's tenure was also controversial due to allegations of graft and corruption, which was linked to the assassination of the Vice President for Administration during his term, Augustus Caesar. Because of his unsatisfactory performance after the recent events, he was suspended from his duty as the president of PUP along with other university officials that are believed to be involved in the aforementioned the scandals. In March 2012, Emmanuel de Guzman was appointed as the new president of PUP after a painstaking transition period. PUP participated in a successful attempt to set a world record for most organ donation pledges in 2014, a project spearheaded by the Department of Health. It broke the record for most organ donation pledges in one hour. 3,548 people signed up in the span of 30 minutes, beating India's 2,755 pledged organ donors. Pup placed third in the Go Green in the City contest held at Paris, France in June 2015, representing the Philippines. Engineering students John Paul Santos and Christian Santa Romana won the award for their invention, the ELECTRIFILTER, electricity generation from filthy water. It generates electricity from waste water, has the capability to filter and cleanse water and is portable so that it can be delivered to places where clean water and electricity are short in supply. In August 2018, it was announced that PUP was in the process of getting a professional and national university status. Of all the state universities and colleges, only the University of the Philippines and Mindanao State University have a chartered national university status. Campus Polytechnic University of the Philippines is located in Santa Mesa, Manila. Its campus lies adjacent to the banks of Pasig River. Most of PUP's buildings are designed as simple and modern. Some of the newest building in PUP are the Tahan ng Atleta, home of the athletes, which was designed in modern Georgian style, and the Engineering and Sciences Research Center designed by prominent Filipino architect and PUP alumnus Royal Pineda. Mabina Campus, Main Campus PUP Main Campus was named after Apolinario Mabina by Dr. Nemesio Prudent, when he reorganized the university in 1988. The sprawling A. Mabina campus, with 10.71 hectares, hosts the core cluster of academic buildings and services. The first building built on the site is the main academic building, which was originally intended to be a military tenement. The main library, known as Ninoy Aquino Library and Learning Resources Center is regarded as one of the largest libraries in Southeast Asia. The historic Mabina shrine located east of the Freedom Plaza, is the house where Apolinario Mabina died. Parks inside the campus include the Luntiang Pilipinas Forest Park, which contains a lagoon and is sealed by walls that imitates Fort Santiago and its walls in Intramuros, and the Pup Linear Park that was constructed in 2006 at the banks of Pasig River. Freedom Plaza was built for Pup's centennial year that was celebrated in 2004. Its construction was finished in 2007. 
Sports facilities in the campus include the Pup Gymnasium and Sports Center, an Olympic-size swimming pool, two basketball courts, tennis courts, and the University Oval, Sports Ground, and Grandstand. NDC Compound Campus the PUP NDC Compound Campus contains the Senior High School, College of Architecture and Fine Arts, College of Communication, College of Engineering, and the Institute of Technology. Among its notable landmark is the Corrito Mansion, which is popularly known as the Antique House. It was transferred by the National Development Corporation to the national government in 1989 which in turn transferred it to PUP. It also contains the PUP BPO Center which was launched through a partnership between PUP and the Civil Service Commission. The campus of PUP was given by the National Development Corporation when it moved out in 1989, transferring all its assets to the national government which in turn will be given to PUP. The campus of the National Development Corporation is leased to several warehouses, factories and other government institutions and private offices. The lessees have the option to purchase the land according to their agreement with the company. When the National Development Corporation decided to move out, however, it decided that all its assets be transferred to the national government and be given to PUP. This was ratified by President Corazon Aquino when she signed Memorandum Order No. 214, S. 1989 on January 6, 1989. Firestone Ceramics, Incorporated is one of the lessees of the National Development Company. It occupies 1.8 hectares adjacent to the A. Mabina campus. The company filed a case against PUP when the university tried to take over the land they occupy. Because the land was protected by a contract between the NDC and Firestone Ceramics that enables the latter to purchase the land, the Supreme Court ruled in favor of Firestone Ceramics and grant its right of first refusal. However, the court acknowledges the need of PUP to expand, but says it can do so in other ways. PUP unsuccessfully tries to take over lot measuring 2,407 meters owned by Golden Horizon Realty Corporation inside the NDC compound whose case is very similar to that of the Firestone Ceramics years earlier. In 2007, PUP purchased two five-story Condotel hostel buildings near its NDC campus from the Government Service Insurance System to accommodate its growing student population. The buildings, known as Pup Conditel, was worth 575.7 million pesos upon its purchase. The Commission on Audit labeled it as a waste of government funds because the buildings are in unusable condition at the time of its purchase. Only Pup Conditel Building A was rehabilitated and is currently in use while Building B is still unusable. The rehabilitation cost already amounted to 101.3 million pesos as of 2013. The overall cost for the buildings, including its rehabilitation, already amounts to 677.1 million pesos and balloons higher as rehabilitation continues. M. H. Del Pilar Campus The PUP M. H. Del Pilar Campus contains the Graduate School and the College of Tourism, Hospitality, and Transportation Management CTHTM. It also contains the Hasman Hostel, formerly a budget hostel which was purchased by PUP in the late 1980s. Currently, it provides the sleeping and residential quarters for the students and faculty of PUP. The hostel also serves as the training grounds for CTHTM students. The current director of the campus is Joseph M. Lardizable. Administration Governance of PUP is vested upon the Board of Regents, which exercises policy-making functions to carry out the mission and programs of the university by virtue of Republic Act No. 8292, the Higher Education Modernization Act of 1997. PUP is administered by Dr. Emmanuel de Guzman, President and he is assisted by an Executive Vice President and six Vice Presidents. As of December 31, 2016, PUP had a total of 3,078 personnel complement, composed of 2,236 faculty, 51 officials, 297 regular employees, 468 casual employees, 18 consultants and 8 job orders inclusive of the branches and campuses. Academics 
PUP is broadly organized into 14 colleges, two high school departments, the laboratory high school and the senior high school, the open university system and a graduate school. It offers an extensive selection of more than 90 undergraduate and graduate programs. The graduate school and the College of Education confers doctoral and master's degrees. The PUP Open University System, which offers its distance learning education programs, is the first institution of distance learning education in the Philippines and is located inside the Ninoy Aquino Library and Learning Resources Center. The Institute of Technology does not require passing the entrance test for admission and offers six diploma programs. PUP formerly has the lowest tuition among all the universities and colleges in the country. With the passage of Republic Act 10,931, students of all state universities and colleges will have a subsidized tuition. Students will now only pay the miscellaneous fee. The oldest college in PUP is the College of Education, tracing its roots back as a course in business education in 1904. From the entrepreneurship courses offered in 1904 began the College of Business Administration, while the College of Accountancy and Finance started in 1960 as a bachelor program in commerce with major in accounting. The College of Computer and Information Sciences started in 1969 as an electronic data process course offered by the College of Accountancy. To develop the culture of sports and athleticism, the present-day College of Human Kinetics was established in 1978 as the College of Physical Education and Sports. The College of Engineering was established in 1986 as the College of Engineering and Architecture. In 2001, several collegiate departments were elevated into its own college which resulted in the establishment of the College of Architecture and Fine Arts, College of Communication, College of Law, and the College of Tourism, Hospitality, and Transportation Management. Its newest academic units are the College of Arts and Letters, College of Political Science and Public Administration and the College of Social Sciences and Development, all of which are founded through an organizational restructuring in 2012. The Pup Laboratory High School, which is one of few high schools in the country offering a commercial curriculum, is regarded as one of the best high schools in the country and serves as the laboratory school of the College of Education where students practice teach. In 2015, the PUP Senior High School was created as a separate department from the Laboratory High School and currently offers all the tracks in the K-12 curriculum. PUP's Bachelor's program in Filipinology and Journalism were recognized by the Commission on Higher Education as Centers of Development. Its Bachelor of Science in Information Technology program was recognized as a Center of Development for Excellence by the Commission on Higher Education from 2000 up to 2006. Student Population, Admission and Enrollment Admission to PUP is selective. To be admitted, aspiring students must pass the PUP College Entrance Test. Admission to selected program is based on the test score and the availability of slots. A different admission test is given to the entrance scholars, the PUP Scholastic Aptitude and Interest Test and they can enroll in any program they like upon passing regardless of slot availability. Of an estimated 50,000 annual PUPCET takers, only 8,000 will be accepted due to the university's limited budget. In 2018, it is estimated that roughly 66,000 took the college entrance exam according to the Philippine Senate President Coco Pimentel. With a population of 71,963 students in 2016, it is the largest state university in the Philippines. PUP claims to maintain an average size of 40 to 50 students per class, but the lack of facilities and growing student population causes overcrowding in classes. A total of 36,527 students in the Manila campus alone are enrolled in the baccalaureate program, while 1,658 undergrads are taking up diploma courses. About 897 students are also enrolled in the undergraduate programs of the PUP Open University and ETEEAP, non-traditional programs. PUP operates year-round with two semesters and a summer. Following the shift to international school calendar, the classes for academic year 2017-2018 was supposed to start in August, but was reverted to June due to the issues regarding the proposed transitional semester by the administration. Summer sessions depend on the program and on the campus. 
More than a hundred of the student population are foreigners from China, Singapore, Indonesia, Cambodia, Myanmar, Tanzania, Nigeria, and Ghana. Also, students from South Korea visits PUP every summer to take up intensive English courses. Research Research is a major function of the university. As a result, research undertakings in PUP is extensive. The Office of the Vice President for Research, Extension, Planning and Development is the official research and planning agency of PUP. PUP is a member of the De La Salle University Commission on Higher Education Zonal Research Center, and the Higher Education Research Consortium Philippines. Three of its research publications are accredited by the Commission on Higher Education. These are the Mabina Review, PUP Journal Science and Technology and the Social Sciences and Development Review. PUP organized the 2011 and hosted the 2013 International Research Conference in Higher Education. The four-story engineering and science research center, designed by Filipino architect Royal Pineda, is the central research building of PUP. Once completed, it will be occupied by the College of Computer and Information Sciences, the College of Engineering and the Institute of Technology. It will enhance future research undertakings of the university. Student life PUP has a variety of long-standing traditions and celebrations such as its month-long founding anniversary held every October, with post-foundation anniversary events being held afterwards. The Pylon Run, held annually at during founding anniversary by the PUP chapter of Alpha Phi Omega is PUP's own version of the Oblation Run. Student organizations PUP's more than a hundred student organizations and clubs cover a wide range of interests. Cultural organizations are under the University Center for Culture and the Arts. The Central Student Council is the undergraduate student government of PUP. Under the Central Student Council is the PUP Commission on Student Organizations and Accreditation which have the mandate to accredit, re-accredit, or revalidate student organizations. Notable political student organizations are the Sandigan ng Mag Aral Para Sa Sambayanan SAMASA, PUP Speak, Laban COC, Tinig Cal, and Lakas CSSD. Popular music organizations include the PUP Bagong Himig Serenata, PUPLHS Chorale, Polysound, and formerly the internationally acclaimed bamboo orchestra group PUP Banda Kawayan, now known as Banda Kawayan Pilipinas, the Federation of Alumni Associations in PUP, Inc., FEDAAPI, is the official alumni association of PUP. It oversees various activities for alumni such as class reunions, local gatherings, alumni travel, and career services. The PUP Tahanan ng Alumni Building was established through FEDAAPI. Activism PUP is known for its student activism. PUP has many student groups focused on political reform. The militant National Democratic Partisan groups are the cause of frequent protest and rallies in the campus. PUP's variety of partisan groups include liberal, socialist, social democratic, and several political organizations. In March 2013, some activist students burned chairs in a protest regarding an alleged tuition hike. The incident came in the wake of the suicide of a University of the Philippines Manila freshman who allegedly could not afford to pay her tuition. The students involved in the violent protest faced sanctions from the university. Student activists, however, have already destroyed school properties way back in 2010, where hundreds of agitated students walked out of the room and began throwing dilapidated chairs, tables, and examination papers from the main building to denounce an allegedly 2,000% tuition hike. PUP is also known for holding one of the first pride marches in Asia, with the first one organized in the 1990s. Since 2016, its LGBT organization Kasarinlan annually holds the PUP Pride March. Pride events are held on March in the university to spread awareness on LGBT rights and push for passage of policies including the anti-discrimination bill. Media PUP has a variety of media outlets. The Observer is PUP's official publication and is published monthly on print and online. The militant student-run newspaper is called The Catalyst. PUP CREA TV is regarded as the first university-based online channel in the Philippines. It was launched in February 2013 and its pioneer programs are The Observer Flash Online, 
Newscast. Puck TV, Panaka USAP Yusupan Sa Pamantasan. Feature Magazine Program, and State U. Web Series. DZMC is the campus radio station operated by the College of Communication. Its programming tentatively include news, sports, educational, children's programs, talk shows, commentaries, to music programs and request shows, mostly geared towards the interests of students, faculty and the administration. All operations have been put on hold, due to reasons of pending license application. DZ1PUP, an amateur radio club, is known for its involvement in a wide range of amateur radio activities, including contesting, research, and community involvement. PUPHAMRCG, a non-profit university-based radio station, is known to assist those who need fast and rapid response communications within the university and nearby areas. Athletics Pup S varsity teams compete in the National Capital Region Conference of the State Colleges and Universities Athletic Association. The university's basketball team also played at the National Athletic Association of Schools, Colleges and Universities in 2013. The athletic teams of PUP are called the Mighty Maroons. Its volleyball and basketball teams plays at the PUP Gymnasium and Sports Center. Softball is played at the Pup Oval Field, which was recently rehabilitated in 2013. Non-varsity student sports clubs that compete with other area universities include the Pup Ultimate, which played at the 2011 University Frixby Championship held at the University of the Philippines Diliman. The University S official volleyball team also played at the second conference of the 12th season of Shaky. SV League and was known as the Pup Lady Radicals, avoiding the usage of the name Mighty Maroons because of its resemblance to the name of rival team Up Fighting Maroons. The team was the replacement for the De La Salle Lady Spikers who pulled out of the league due to its commitment in other tournaments. The Pup Stars Cheerleading Team, the official cheerleading team representative of Pup, was formed in 1998 and was the champion in the 2011 SCUAA NCR Cheerdance competition. They were also the champion in the 2006 and 2010 season of the Philippine Inter-Schools, Colleges and Universities Athletic Association Cheerdance Competition. People Persons affiliated to the university, either as students, faculty members, or administrators, are called as Pupians. Like in all Philippine state universities, students and graduates are also called Iskolar ng Bayan. Scholars of the Nation Alumni Some of the most famous alumni of PUP include Sater Ocampo, political activist and a member of the House of Representatives of the Philippines, Romulo Macalintal, election lawyer, Celia Capadocia Yango, who once served as the Secretary of Social Welfare and Development, and Ted Phelan a former politician and a broadcast journalist. Former presidential candidate and spiritual leader of Jesus is Lord Church, Eddie Villanueva. Other legal figures include Miguel Cuaderno, first governor of the Central Bank of the Philippines, Antonieta Fortuna IBE, the Securities and Exchange Commission Commissioner and former chairperson of the Professional Regulation Commission, and Diosdado N. Silva, the Assistant General Manager of the Philippine National Railways and a lawyer. PUP alumni serving as CEOs or company presidents and executives include Fernando L. Martinez, the founder and CEO of Eastern Petroleum, Joey Bermudez, the former president President of the Philippine Veterans Bank, Olive Ramos, the CEO of Southeast Asian Airlines, CR, now called Tiger Air Philippines, Henry M. Tan, a certified public accountant and the president of the PICPA Eastern Metro Manila Chapter, the former president and CEO of Chowking. PUP alumni in the academia include Galcozo C. Alboro, one of Metrobank Foundation. S. Outstanding Teachers in the Field of Filipino Literature, Ed Teovicio, one of Metrobank Foundation. S. Outstanding Teachers for 2012, Francisco de Lupin Sr., the founder of the University of the East and Rev. Fr. Herminio Dago Hoy, the Rector Magnificus of the University of Santo Tomas, in the area of religion and theology. PUP alumni includes Eddie Villanueva, the founder and spiritual director of the Jesus as Lord Church Worldwide. 
In film, entertainment, television, PUP is represented by 2006 Binavining Pilipinas International title holder Daniel Lu Valmonte, actors Bayani Agbayani, and Tato Jimenez, singer Lizel Garcia, comedians such as Michael Pecto, Nakua, Albert Sumaya Jr., popularly known as Betong, and James Ronald and Rodphil Obiso, the duo brothers who are better known as Moimoy Palaboy. Filipino TV hosts that are graduates of PUP include Love Anyover, and broadcaster and former politician Mario Teodoro Phelan Itong. Notable reporters that are graduates of PUP include Steve Dalison, Maricel Halili, Mark Logan, and Mon Macapagal, as well as radio disc jockey John Gemperly, better known as Papa Jack. Nationally known remarkable alumni include Dr. Rustic Acarpio, who is entitled to the Ulirang Artista Lifetime Achievement Awardee. References External links Polytechnic University of the Philippines